Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Maple Story Shade. Um, now, in the last episode, we did some more just hunting quests and training and stuff like that, and just gaining levels. So, we're all. Wait, the first question what's my favorite? Ma uh. Raw Lever. Fox God. Uh. Handle spirits. That's right. Okay. I heard you got one suit from the fox god. Use it wisely. Alright, so that's... Oh, that was his quest? Really? He's a home... Wait, he did... Ah, I didn't read to tell him... Ask. Oh, oh, it was patience? Okay. Alright, finally you're here. I hope you get as good as a teacher says. The chicks uh, living around here are vicious little things picking on poor little kids. Uh, teach me a lesson. It looks like you that someone is you. Can you do it? All right, our babies are going to uh, learn to fear chicks unless we do something. All right. Uh, great. Just kick around 60 delinquent chicks for us. All right, 60 is a lot. Almost there. Are these the chicks? Yes, sir. And of course they go out in one hit because we're that good. We gotta take out 60 of these. Which should be pretty quick. I mean, we already got 15. Look at that. Whoops. Probably should buy um the the mana elixir that that heals 300 mana points. Should be okay. For now, I mean, I should buy more pots in general, but whatever. I got to defeat nine more, and as you can see, it gave us a ton of experience. So, up. That's, that's what I'm looking for, the experience. Look at, look at all the experience it gives us. Look at that. Granted, we are at a low level, but come on. That's a lot of experience. Alright, let's go back. Oh man, look at that too. More, more of these frogs. They give pretty good experience themselves. So... Look at all the frogs here. I bet the green frogs give out more experience. Alright. I love monsters that just... They they quickly spawn. I like that. Because they, they, it turns into good grinding areas. So, Alright, got this done. Over 3,000 experience. And Mrs. Brook. So that's where we're gonna go next. You only need one more. Now I can finally start upping my health and uh, permanently increase weapon defense. Magic defense. Yeah, alright, awesome. So I'm, now I'm gonna get mega bulky because this guy's defense is off the charts. Alright, Brooks. What do you need me to do for you? I hope your skin looks so pale and sensitive today. Uh, um, okay, you know, we were talking uh, we were talking like we do, and we thought it would be lovely to see those delinquent chicks get taught a lesson, don't you know? I just, I just, I just beat them. The punk chick is, oh, the punk chick is even worse. So I'm pretty sure it's the one that's the one... That's in the area after it. You know, taking a wild guess. Just a wild guess. Let's see. I might cut this one out. Yeah. And then they give... I'm pretty... Yeah, they give even more experience. Look at this. Alright. 
Alright, so I'm gonna do this. I'll just cut this one out and I'll see you guys in a bit. Alrighty. So we got this done. Let's level up really quick. Because I'm, I'm telling you, man, the experience that these things give is crazy. Alright. On our way back, oh my gosh, so much. I can't help but just destroy them because it's just so much experience. I got a high combo going. I don't know if that matters. Let's get to 100. Just because I can. I don't know if like there's like a time limit in like the combos. Because I know when Iran had the combos, um, there was like a certain time where you had to get them. Like, you had a time limit. So. Alright, so I got the. Alright, I got the 100 combo. 101. I don't know if that does anything, but. Probably didn't do anything. Just got a bunch of experience. Alright. I did what you want, Brooke. Alright, oh, a lot of XP for that one. Alright, so now I gotta go see Moonbeam. And uh, I leveled up, so let's up this. My de up my defense and uh, and my health and everything, so that's cool. Alright, so monsters. Whoa, you got four paw stamps already? Maybe you're not so helpless after all here. I can just give you mine. Oh, the whole test uh, testing isn't required or anything. It's my paw stamp, so I can do whatever I want. Where do you want it? Oh, okay, so she just gives us hers. Uh, I think I was looking this way. He's treating me like a kit. A kit? Whatever. Are you gonna... Are you gonna give it to me or what? Alright. Alright, yeah, I got it. I leveled up again without doing anything. Alright. Alright, now let's see what you got to say. Did you get all the paw stamps? I sure did! Splendid, you pass all the tests. From now on, I, Silver Chief of Fox Point Village, hereby declare you a true fox, one of our kin. Alright, accept the new paw stamp as proof. Cool. Alright, just for you too. It feels like only yesterday you came to this town. And wait, was it yesterday? Yeah, I, actually, it, does this count as today? I, I think it, I don't think I went to sleep yet, dude, so yeah. I don't remember anyway, now you're an official fox. I'm very proud of you. You should be proud too. Oh, and I hear our people prepared another gift. Oh, nice. So I wonder what that is. Hopefully it's not raw liver again. I gotta pretend that I ate it. Alright, ooh, it's a hat? Is it a hat? Would I look to go to tutorial cutscene? Skip it, no, I wouldn't want to skip a uh, special gift, fox ears and a tail, huh? Well, um, could be worse, I guess. I really, really don't like this, but accepting it would be out of line, as I might, might as well give it a try. <laughs> Wait, no, I can't do this, not after what I've been through. I, I like it here, but I don't want to lose who I am, I don't like this. No, I, I should hide this before I do anything else. You took it off. It's interesting. Shade, something bad is happening. Well, I'm not in the best situation anywhere. Anyway, what happened? It's raining in the town. So? Rain, hmm, I guess this is the first time I've seen it rain in this town. But why is it so bad? Are the damages to the houses? No, no, raining means it means you should hear it from the chief himself. Okay, I gotta go talk to him. Alright, so it's raining outside. I don't know why rain is so bad. I actually like the rain. Let's see what's up. Right, oh, Shay, thank goodness. Uh, what do we do? It's raining. Uh, get an umbrella. My grandfather... My, my granddaughter is such a troublemaker. It simply rains... It simply never rains in our village. It does. If it does, that means a fox is crying somewhere. 
It takes more than a few tears to bring a downpour like this. Uh, what worries me is that Moonbeam is missing. Alright, so we gotta go find her then. No one in the town is crying, so it must be Moonbeam. She hasn't cried a tear since she lost her mother and father. Though something awful must have happened. So I gotta go find her. Um, she was last seen on the fox tree, so there might be a clue there. Alright, here's a little animal. The hell is that thing? Scuffle, why are you all alone? No, Moomin doesn't even have her spirit. Alright, maybe she left clues around. Alright, tigers. Uh, there really are tigers around here, Moomin. I gotta get rid of the, all the tigers first. Alright, so. Let's up my levels and my stats. Let's take out these things, which go down in one attack. Do I have to take out all of them? I don't even get experience for this. I'll probably just get all the experience in the end. Alright, you need a bet. What? Oh. Alright, it's my fault. I should have kept it close in the eye. Right. All your fault, Shade. It's all your fault. Let me let me skip it this time. I'm pretty sure it's nothing. Hey, look, there she is. But I gotta defeat the tiger, dude. I'm my defense is way too high for you, bro. You got you can't do anything to me. See, now I'm interested in the cutscene. Like nothing, man. I shouldn't have skipped it. Oh well. All right, it was so scary. I hate ugly tigers. Nope, not skipping it this time. I'm not making that same mistake again. Are you okay? Are you hurt? Oh, my, my whole body aches. Here, here, and here. You, you don't have a scratch on you. I must be bleeding internally. Oh, the fox manatee. I need to get back to the town for treatment. Thanks for nothing, you big jerk. Right, did I say something wrong again? I wish she'd tell me what I did wrong. I'm glad she's okay, at least. Ouch. Just bumped my, my elbow into freaking... Alright. Let's talk to Silver. Alright, my granddaughter is such a troublemaker just for you three. Oh, I got another gift? Alright. Alright. Yeah, I surely should be prepared for this one. I think deep inside they know that I don't give a crap about any of these gifts. Not that I don't care about these gifts, just that they're not exactly what I need. What is this? Wow, this is really nice. The metal means that I, uh, they've accepted me. No more tests, no more suspicions. Is this what having a family is like? Alright, it's been so long. The Black Mage, the Seal, Maple World, everything feels like a dream. I've gotten used to things around here. Maybe someday I can go back to Maple World, but do I ever want to? I do! Oh, is it a metal? Can I put it on? Hold on. Ooh! Cool, even more HP. Yeah! Alright. So, let me do, let me do one more quest and then I'll end the episode. Um, alright, I gotta talk to Moonbeam. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna keep this episode a little bit shorter than usual, so. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this episode of uh, Shade, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.